everyone, Velma Garns here, also known as the Velminator, your permanent results coach. This is day 23 of 365 days of my motivational moment, which starts right now. I'm going to give this 90 seconds. We'll see how this goes. But today I wanted to explain to you what is happening in your brain when you meditate. And here's the best way that I've come up with to explain this to you. So this, let's pretend this is associated with our brain waves here. We have consciousness, we have subconsciousness. We have, we have beta, alpha, theta, delta, because as you slip into subconsciousness, your brain waves start to slow down. So you have fast brain waves and you have slow brain waves here at the bottom. So beta and alpha, beta is in the awake state here and alpha is that section there that's intertwined between the two paper clips that is associated with both consciousness and subconsciousness so as you're sort of meditating here you're starting to slow down your brain waves theta and delta are the only two that are associated with your subconscious mind so this is where you're in sleeping state so awake and asleep consciousness subconsciousness beta alpha theta delta alpha alpha is that bridge to get into your subconscious state so that's what's going on in your brain waves now the reason why this is important is because most of us when we get into any sort of meditation we are coming to it because we are trying to well this is why i came to it let me let me just stop lying. but the reason why i came into it is because i really wanted to slow down my brain waves because i had a lot of repetitive and fast thoughts so the way that i figured out to slow it down after everything else that i tried i found that meditation worked really well for me and so the reason why this is important is because most of us come into meditation because we want to um we want to relax or we want to um go to sleep we want to relax or we want to reduce our stress that is a great reason to come into meditation but what i'm telling you you can do so much more when you enter into the subconscious mind whatever's going on in the subconscious mind is what's happening in the foreground of your life so the more you start to reduce those brain waves and slow them down you can do so much more in the foreground of your life if you really want to change things if you don't, I'd say keep coming to it because you want to relax and sort of reduce your stress. But there's so much more that's involved with it that it's not even funny. So I'm going to stop talking there. And hey, what's going on, guys? Thank you for joining me. I'm going to wave at you. Hey, Will. <laughs> what's going on? It's good to see you here. Thank you, guys. Um, so that is it. I'm going to talk a little bit more about this because we're spending the whole week on meditation. Go ahead and download that induction and to get to get into your meditation. I have a link to it that's in my bio. And if you're on my Facebook fan page, it's also above the video that is going to be in there. All right. So I will see you tomorrow. Bye.